don't forget, folks, if you want to go drag racing and be good at it, you need to have Nitrous Express and a good time. Oh, okay, this day all started at 5.30 a.m. when me and the co-pilot got loaded up and started making our way towards Lindy's flashlight cash days. The views were nice on the way, but when I tell you it is open and flat for miles, I mean miles. As we started to pull in, I just barely got in to the racetrack, and what do you know, someone rode right up. So man, what was your name again? Jimmy Sullivan. It's nice to meet you, Mr. Sullivan. We got a beautiful car out here. This GTO is definitely a piece of work. Uh, you were telling me a little bit, you got big tires on it right now. Yes, sir. But what were you saying? We're, we're fixing the 28 tires. We're doing a small tire race again. Hey, he's joining the club, man. 28105 is where all the cool guys go, right? right? That's where all the cool guys go. Can you tell me, um, I might know the answer to this question, but is it a big block or is it a small block, it's, sir? It's, it's a it's a medium block. That's a that's a medium block right there. Oh, okay. I, I heard they started making them medium blocks nowadays. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it looks like it might have a little bit of spray on it, sir. A little bit. A little bit. About how much y'all spraying today? Uh, everything you can fit in. Everything you can fit in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like the way that sounds, man. Uh, so you're out here. You're running in the run what you brung class, right? They don't want to let you run in small tire. They don't. They don't want you beating up on people. Well, how long have you had this car, man? Um, we've had this car about a year and a half. Now. About a year and a half. Did it always have a big block in it? Yeah. Yeah. Always been a nitrous car. Is there a besides putting some small tires on it? Is there any other plans you got for it this no, next year? Keep it going straight. Keep it going safe. Well, man, good luck today. Thank you, buddy. God bless you. Yes, I'm trying to do some wheelies for us today, man. Ooh. Would y'all look at that? People are starting to finally flow in now. Yeah. Can you tell me a little bit about the cars? A small block, big block? It's about a 540 a TKM all aluminum. Really? Yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. So you're big block and turbo. Turbo 400, two speed 400 in it. Nice. my dream car. Gotta get that pull away shot from the turbo, you know? Man, so, what's your name again? Jake McDaniels. Jake McDaniels, nice to meet you. Is this a 66 or a 67? 67. This is a beautiful piece of work, man. Tell me, tell us a little bit about the car. It's got a small block in it. 434 LSX, power glide transmission, 76 to 75 millimeter turbos. Yeah. So you got a small block, LS, twin turbo. How long you said you've been that? You just barely got this car painted, you were telling me, huh? Been painted about two weeks. How long y'all been having the car together running, making passes? Two years. Two years now? 
Y'all come out to this area a lot? So, yeah, so this is y'all's hometown track. So you might know this surface. Just a little bit, right? Now, I ain't gonna show this to nobody until the radio's done. But let us know, because we're gonna see what happens today, and I wanna see if you can call it. What kind of times can this surface handle? Hopefully, we'll run a 560. 560s. Check, check, check. <laughs> All right, you heard it. <laughs> you already know that face. Tell me, Limpy, we're out here in Mexico or? No, it's the new. The newer part of Mexico. The newer part of Mexico, right? Yeah. What are we doing out here today? How many cars do you think we're going to see? There's already quite a few cars here. That's right. Uh, we got one from Canada. From Canada? All the way from Canada. God almighty. Freaking, they brought some maple syrup down here, thinking they might be able Canadian to stick. Bacon. Canadian bacon. <laughs> it's just regular ham. It's just regular ham. Uh, you got the Texas people come. Yep. You got more Texas people come. Heard some Tennessee folks are out here. Tennessee folks out here. Uh, it'll be a good time. Hell yeah. Always good seeing Limpy. Wasn't long after that till it was time to start the driver's meeting. I want to thank everybody for coming tonight today. For the radio, it's 91.5. If you want to hear the announcement or anything we need you guys to know, just listen to the radio and you'll hear it. We're missing the driver. We're missing her. Somebody's pulling up over there. <laughs> I'm still missing some tech cars. Anybody got a tech car? Somebody's on the break over there. Yeah. <laughs> Is this Steve? Is Steve over there, clown? All right, now on the she knows. Order, we're gonna start with the daily. We have 17 cars daily. Then we're gonna start with the True Street. We have uh, 15 cars on the True Street. We got eight cars, small tire next. Five one one two brown and eight Calgates. Plus, there's $250 donated by Justin Navarro. For the tailgate class, that's on top of the entry. So whoever wins it gets all the entries plus $250. Nice. All right. Anyone want to donate to any class to help out? All right. I got Canadian money. Does that count? The what? I got some Canadian money. It might be worth 10 cents. Or hundred dollars might be worth maybe five dollars here. Throw some maple in there. All right, guys. With almost fourteen thousand dollars up for grabs, everyone was eager to get the first round started.
a 60 foot. Golly. Go on, get him, Winder. them all the way down.
dude. For the people who don't know what happened, they might have saw you make a pass. But you made a fast pass at small tire. And then what happened? Threw a belt. Threw a belt. When it got when it threw a belt. It overheated, so I had to sit over there for a little while and let it cool off. Yeah. And then I had to come back over here, get fans on it, and then we had 10 minutes. And then the exhaust, when we were putting the turbos on, we forgot to put the bolts in so the exhaust is about to fall off. Oh lord. So we had to put bolts in the exhaust, put your belt on, uh, cool it off, tune it. Dude, that sounds like like and that, add weight. That sounds like, like five like, tenths. It's like fifteen. It's like five tenths right there, right there. Just by bolting up the exhaust, that's five tenths. <laughs> so then, you get into it, run what you brung, right? Yeah. You roll up there. What's on your mind when you roll up there? I hope it holds the belt. I hope, hope the belt stays on. <laughs> Did it hold the belt? It held the belt. No help. I tightened the whole shit out of it. Success. Success. Yeah. So we're good. So he was with me for a little bit. He was. And then I, I hit the button. And just... I am excited to see that GoPro video it's because only, it's not a big gap. Not a big area. He, he was. Was, he was there. He was probably in the field of the GoPro. Unlike the first guy, yeah, he, he was, was probably sure. in the field of the GoPro for most of the video. <laughs> well, dude, again, good luck to the next round. Thank you. Thank you.
would say his lights are further back though, it's a problem. So his the, the nose of that I mean, I think I'm out front, but if you said uh, we had to rerun, I wouldn't argue. I was about to say, it's so close, bro. That's the problem is his bumper. Yeah. There's no light on the bumper, the and it's bumper, black, so it's hard to see The it. lights are here, and the bumper is actually here. I'm not going to argue that. <laughs> I mean, I tried. Is there a rerun, or what is I it? Mean, yeah, that's I mean, what we're yeah. trying to figure out. Congratulations to Steve and the rest of the little family on his wins tonight. Congratulations to the rest of the winners that also came out and showed their stuff. Always had a good time seeing Limpy, Michael, and many of the others that came out to the race. If y'all aren't already, y'all try to come out, be involved in the racing scene. And if you're not already, subscribe to God's Garage for more cool racing content. Thank y'all for watching.